Fresh herbs, feta, and big flavor. You're going to love this next recipe. Executive chef David McMillan is here from the Bird Cafe in Fort Worth to show us how to make a Texas Sopsi. Such a unique dish. It smells wonderful already. How are you, David? I'm very good. How are you this morning? I'm great. So tell me about what we're making today. Okay, Sopsi, Sopsi Cordon. Uh, it's spelled with a K if you want to look that up. Most people just call it Sopsi. It's, it's Persian in, in its mm -hmm. history. I had some great, lived in LA, had some great Persian friends. Uh, one of them was an artist, and he would always begin his parties outside in his patio with platters of flatbreads, feta, cucumber, onion, and whatever sweet herbs mm. that were running around the market. Sweet herbs being things like basil, mint, tarragon, dill, Anything you want with parsley, cilantro, not the hard ones, not like thyme and rosemary that are just not fun to chew. Sure. And it's it's extremely simplistic, but it's so rewarding and mm -hmm. it, 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 it just happens to be healthy. It uh, smells yeah, not the plan, so but good. if you know you're you're looking at spring and summer where, where there's this amount of, of fresh produce is being grown, herbs can grow anywhere. You mm -hmm. can grow you can grow all these things in your backyard. Sure. In a pot, a planter. A hanging basket, and it just, you know what, and they are better grown at home. I bet. And they're easy. Most most Fresh. herbs are really weeds around the world. Sure. Well, the, it so smells amazing, well. and they shouldn't be called weeds because it ah. is going to be amazing. So what do we do here to make, it seems pretty easy. It's extremely easy. Okay, so cool. We have a couple ways you can set this up. I, I laid the herbs out so you can see them ahead of time. Mm -hmm. uh, it's not uncommon to lay the bread underneath it. And then just lay your, lay can you all on see top. that? They're so pretty, all these pretty herbs. And, and then we're going to just break some chunks of feta. Oh. And y'all know I love cheese. And you know, it, it does look pretty healthy and bikini season's coming. We got to get ready for that. So if you're like me, you're going to be real healthy and drink the cocktail while you're oh. enjoying your sausage, you right? You have, that's your dessert too. You know, exactly. The sugar, you got to have a little that. dessert. All right. Now you can put pepper on it or not. You can put olive oil on it or not. Okay. You can actually fry, you know, coriander seed, cumin seed mm. in the oil, just lay it flat over the top. But this is a really nice Greek feta, so mm -hmm. I'm, I'm just going to absolutely Let leave it, it plain because it is so good. But again, so these are, you can buy Persian cucumbers, mm -hmm. you can buy the English cucumbers. Oh. Uh, you really don't buy the, the, the traditional American cucumbers because the, the skins are thick. They're the, good uh, for juicing, but not for sauce. Right. Yeah, they, they, <laughs> Got and, it. and the seeds are big, and sure. you know they're they're kind of a commitment to get through. Sure. Uh, this is tarragon again. We already have a good pile of it. But just see, all you do mm. is pick off the soft leaves. There's some Got woody it. stems you want to leave behind. Sure. And then when the basil's really oh, get going, basil's you know, you can even garnish. You know, the flowers and the seasons oh, develop pretty. a little bit more. Yeah. It and is so, so you cute. guys serve this up at your restaurant. We are getting ready to put it out on, we have that great patio, sure. we have a real spectacular patio. Plus we have a deck up above with a fire pit and circular sort of couch pieces laid Whoa. around there. So this will be a share plate. I got It'll it. It'll be, we want it to be, you know, like that'll be very close to that. Oh, absolutely. And it's just very, very, very fun. So we've got onions, we've got mint, we've got dill chive, mm -hmm. cucumber, and basil. Okay. So we can serve this on another plate, you can serve this on another plate. Or you can just go ahead and take a chunk. That's what I'm talking about right there. And then what do we do? You pick what you want. Oh, really? It and is just finger go for food. it? Yep. And like, do I just pull the cheese? Yep. Mm. It's a really good one. It is very, very good. I'll right. put some basil on there. Now, do you warm the bread up or anything? Nope. Just like this? Yep. Because so you're sitting simple. outside. You know, Which, it is going to be hot, and, right? And, and Texas, so you need something cool to kind of, yeah, again. You too. You know, this, this has you know, has roots mm -hmm. in the Middle East, mm -hmm. so it's already warm, mm -hmm. a, a warm climb. Um, and it's just, you know, it is good, isn't it? Sopsy, cocktail to wash it down. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're done. You know, with as, as nice as the weather's getting in Texas, this would be perfect. And you guys are right there in Sundance Square. It's great. Go hang out with your friends and have some sopsy, right? This will, this, this will, people will love it. I, mean, I, I know we have, great. you know, it's going on the menu and we just, I have great faith that this is going to be one of the number one well, things we do. Well, it's very fresh. It shares so well. Yes, which is so big. If you're sitting on a patio enjoying cocktails, you need something you can share with your friends, right? And like I said, it's hot in Texas in the summer. This is nice and cool. It's delicious. And, you know, being healthy is a byproduct, but it's really, it's very flavor driven. It's just, you know, you hit the fat. It is. Out. All the different, ah. different, it's just, it's just fabulous. It is. Okay, I'm going to finish eating, thing. all right? And you can get this fresh recipe by visiting our website, thebroadcasttv.com, and click on today's links. Stay with us. We'll be right back with more broadcasts.